The first thing we need to do to edit the skin is to make a copy of this background layer. So I'm going to go ahead and click background, right click, duplicate layer. Now you'll see I have the background layer and then I have background copy. I'm going to rename this to skin. So a couple ways to edit the skin. One way is to use the spot heal tool. Another way is to use a blur effect. We're actually going to do both. Uh, one in this video and one in another video, and you can see the differences. The blur effect skin tool is actually a lot more advanced, but it gives a really nice glow and smoothness to the skin, so I definitely think it's worth exploring. The easier of the two ways is to use the spot heal tool. So if you come over to the toolbar and click on, looks like a little band-aid, you'll see the spot heal tool. Once you have it clicked on, you can change the size up here typically smaller is a little bit better so we'll go about 30 close enough all right you can see where it says blended nearby or generate pattern we're going to do blend nearby which is already selected for us and then i'm going to just zoom in to my model's face and i'm just going to start clicking and what it's going to do is blend the colors of the skin together in the surrounding area now if i were to not click one point at a time and do something like that it would be a little bit less natural effect so it is a good idea to come in here and you know you can drag a little bit but mostly just click and i'm going to let you while i'm doing this i'm going to let you use the spot hill tool to edit the skin of your photograph okay now i've finished using the spot hill tool if I come over to the layers panel and I toggle between the skin layer so that it's on and then off, you'll see the difference. So this is on and this is off. It's a subtle difference, which is fine because that's what the spot heel tool is good for. But you definitely see that the freckles are much more pronounced when the skin layer is off versus when it's on. Now, as I mentioned earlier, I think this girl's freckles are beautiful. I'm just showing you what you can do with skin in general if you have you know, acne or, or other kind of scars or blemishes that you want to hide. So that's the spot heel tool. The next tool I'm going to show you is the Gaussian blur effect, and it is also a great tool for continuing to smooth out skin.